Hello friends. Welcome to our channel. Today we are going to talk about 15 early signs that you are becoming diabetic. Here we have covered potential signs of type 1 and type 2 diabetes mellitus. Before we start, please note, this information is for educational purposes only and not advice. Please contact to any qualified physician for any concerns. Signs are First point, frequent urination. If you find yourself going to the bathroom more often than usual, it could be a sign of diabetes. This happens because high blood sugar levels cause the kidneys to work harder to filter the excess sugar out of the blood. Second point, increased thirst. Frequent urination can lead to dehydration, which can make you feel thirsty more often. Third point, significant weight loss. If you are losing weight without trying, it could be a sign of diabetes. This happens because your body is not able to use glucose for energy, so it starts breaking down fat and muscle instead. Fourth point, fatigue. When blood sugar levels are high, the body's cells may not be able to effectively use glucose as a source of energy. This can result in feelings of fatigue and lethargy even if you are getting enough rest. Also, diabetes can cause sleep disturbances, including sleep apnea and restless leg syndrome, which can lead to fatigue during the day. Fifth point, blurry vision. Diabetes can cause changes in the blood vessels into the eyes, leading to blurry vision. Sixth point, slow healing. High blood sugar levels can also affect the body's ability to heal cuts and wounds, so if you notice that your cuts are taking longer than usual to heal, it could be a sign of diabetes. High blood sugar levels can cause damage to blood vessels, reducing blood flow to the affected area and limiting the delivery of oxygen and nutrients needed for the healing process. Seventh point, tingling or numbness in hands and feet. Diabetes can cause damage to blood vessels, reducing blood flow to the hands and feet. This can result in tingling or numbness due to lack of oxygen and nutrients to the affected areas. Eighth point, feeling hungry. Despite eating regularly, people with diabetes may feel hungry all the time. When blood sugar levels are high, the body may not be able to effectively use glucose as a source of energy leading to feelings of hunger. Ninth point, dark patches of skin. This is also called acanthosis nigricans, is a skin condition that results in dark, ticked patches of skin, typically in the folds and wrinkles of the body, such as the neck, armpits, groin, and under the breasts. The patches may feel velvety or slightly raised and can be of varying shades of brown. Tenth point, sugar cravings. You will likely crave a sweet or sugary snakes shortly post your meals. Eleventh point, puffy faces and puffy eye and eyelids. When blood sugar levels are high, the body may retain more water, leading to swelling and puffiness in the face and around the eyes. Point number twelve, skin tags. Mostly all has one or two skin tags, which is very normal. If it starts growing too many, it could be sign of prediabetic. Diabetic patients with insulin resistance may have higher levels of insulin in their blood, which can stimulate the growth of skin cells and increase the likelihood of developing skin tags. Sometimes skin tags may also develop due to hormonal changes or due to genetics. Point number 13. Tired after you eat meal. Post your meal generally you should feel energetic and strong and not very tired. If so, it's a sign of early stage of diabetes. 
Fourteenth point. Itchy skins. People with pre-diabetic gets dry and patches on skin because of high blood sugar and insulin damages blood vessels. Also, your skin will be more susceptible to bacterial or fungal infections. Fifteenth point. Brain fog. One possible reason for brain fog in diabetes is that high blood sugar levels can cause inflammation and damage to the blood vessels in the brain. This can impair circulation and reduce the amount of oxygen and nutrients that reach the brain cells, which can cause cognitive impairment and memory problems. In addition, diabetes can also affect the balance of hormones and neurotransmitters in the brain, which can contribute to symptoms of brain fog. Sometimes low blood sugar, which can lead to confusion and difficulty concentrating. If you are experiencing any of these symptoms, it is important to consult a doctor for testing and diagnosis. Early detection and management of diabetes can help prevent complications and improve long-term health outcomes. If you like this information, then please press like button and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.